The controls are pretty simple. Appear to be quite large. So he has big feet, or she. No, it's gonna be he. Big feet. So you can do These the same. Footprints appear. Okay, you can redo. What else can he do? Oh, imagination talent helps you visualize objects and events. It seems that the garden was well maintained. So, someone with OCD? No? Oh, wait! Oh, wow, you can change view. Do we like it like this? Oh, we can't even walk over the garden. Just checking the textures. Right, where to? Oh, we okay. Have we missed anything? There's a lot to. Oh, we can run. Yay. Can I s exit? Inspector Lestrade, when will you remove my husband's body? It's sacrilegious to leave him here like this. As soon as we can, Mrs. Carey, I assure you. Allow me to introduce you to Mr. Sherlock Holmes. He's a detective. No doubt you've heard of him. I'll wait for you in front of the cabin, Mr. Holmes. My condolences, Mrs. Carey. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. The garden is very large and well maintained. Do you employ someone to look after it? It is true. Well, there is a lot of work, but my husband took care of it himself. Madam, can you tell me if you saw or heard anything unusual upon the night of the murder? At two o'clock in the morning, I heard a terrible scream. But I thought nothing of it then. He would scream all the time when he was drunk. Can you please tell me what occurred on the evening of the murder? Well, Peter got drunk in the evening. He was in such a terrible temper. Usually whenever that happened, he'd stay all night drinking in his cabin before passing out. Do you remember at what time you found your husband's body? In the morning, at around seven o'clock. I noticed the cabin door was open but I didn't go in to take a look, for I knew my husband would not have liked it. At around ten o'clock, I dared to glance in through the door and... Oh, dear. Was your husband accustomed to receiving visitors? Oh, no. I don't think so. I mean, he didn't really have many friends. We lived quite an isolated life here, after his retirement. What? The hell? I hear ticking. Do we have a time limit? Okay, this is interesting. Brewer house. So we're going through. Hmm. 
we missed something. Skip. I don't want to skip. There's one more. Aha! You have indeed suffered a great loss, Mrs. Carey. Nevertheless, I believe it will be less of a burden for you soon. Yes. Life with Peter was never easy. But he was still my husband. He was different, wasn't he? When you first met him upon your return from Plymouth. Yes, Mr. Holmes. Oh my goodness, but how do you know about that? Choose the evidence that confronts the statement, so... What? You have indeed suffered a great loss, Mrs. Carey. Nevertheless, I believe it will be less of a burden for you soon. Yes. Life with Peter was never easy. But he was still my husband. He was different, wasn't he? When you first met him upon your return from Plymouth. Yes, Mr. Holmes. Oh my goodness, but how do you know about that? You undertook a pilgrimage to the Cathedral of Santiago de Compostela when you were young. That much is evident from the rosary in your hand. The shortest route for the pilgrim from England to Spain is from Plymouth. I believe that you met Peter Carey as a young sailor there, and you married him soon afterwards. That is indeed what happened, Mr. Holmes. How extraordinary. Thank you, madam. Mr. Holmes. It seems that the garden was well maintained. Can we go into the house? Peter Carey's body is inside the cabin. We took care not to touch anything. Okay, here we go. The door is locked. Wait just a moment, Mr. Holmes, and I'll open it. I locked it yesterday to ensure that no one should enter the cabin and tamper with the evidence. Ah, good thinking. Hello, hello, hello. What is it, Lestrade? It seems to me that someone has tried to force it, Mr. Holmes. Let me see. Okay, what are we looking for exactly? Door lock. Scratch. Okay. These scratches are fresh. You're right. Someone tried to force open the door. I swear these scratches were not here yesterday. Now a mysterious visitor came here last night. Well... He's not the man for the job. This lock is not a difficult one. Perhaps he did not have the right tool. Hmm. 
What a terrible way to die. The tooth of a sperm whale, probably from one of Peter Carey's catches. <laughs> 